Have me here with the head coach of Towson University, Diane Richardson. Coach Richardson, first of all, congrats. Congrats on the NCAAs and getting there. And what, what, what was it like last year to uh, go through that experience and earn that trip to the NCAA tournament? Well, it was exciting. It was, you know, the first time it had been done in Towson history, so that made it even special. But it was special because our young ladies worked really hard for it. Um, Coach, you all drew UConn, and <laughs> UConn, UConn, it don't matter who the opponent is, UConn's a real tough draw. They are. These are the play. Um, yeah. Just talk about having to play them and what you learned from that experience. So, Well, you know, UConn is a story team, so we knew that we'd have a tough game when we got up there. But, you know, in, do in playing them, we saw that level of basketball. And our girls did not quit the entire game. That they played the entire game, didn't let up. And it, from that, we, you know, we knew that we had to be better to be able to play against a team in the NCAA tournament. So this year, we worked on it and worked real hard. And the girls were you know, stepping up for it. Um, and it's tough enough to go through the CAA. Um, just yes. talking having to go through that tournament and win it because that that's that is not yeah, an easy conference to play. Yeah, that's a tough conference. Very very tough. You know, like I said, three of the teams in the conference were top mid uh, top twenty five mid majors. So we've got a very tough conference. And so night in and night out, it's very competitive. Um, what do you think if, if you guys can get back to the tournament? What do you think it'll take that? For this time, not just to get there, but to win at yeah, the tournament. Win. What is well, it going to take? You know, one of the things we did, we worked on our depth, so we would have more players in our rotation, so that we can go hard the entire entire game. We're up tempo type team, so we press and we play some tough man to man, and it helps to have people on the bench to be able to sub. Coach, um, talk about your your non conference schedule. Mm -hmm. Obviously challenging. Yes, yeah, very challenging and you know I believe you got to play the best if you want to be the best and so we open up with some Big Ten opponents. We uh, we have Penn State uh, our first game of the season. We go out to play Iowa. We're playing Rutgers. We're playing Temple and, and Marshall. So we've got some tough non-conference games to prepare us for our season. Um, and special preparing to go into the CAA. Now, you're not used to going in to conference with a target on your back, but that I guess that's the reality right now. That's a, and a totally different challenge. How do, you, mm -hmm. how do you plan to approach that? That's the good part and the bad part, I guess, like about winning. It's not only is it a good experience to win, but then you know people know what you have, and then you do have a target on your back. So we've got to be prepared. We've got to worry about us and step up our game even better than we were last year. Um, just talk about the plays you have coming back and uh, how, and how the experience they have uh, will help. Yeah. Well, we've got four of our five starters returning, so we've got a lot of experience there, experience of players that played a lot of minutes last year. And then we have some transfers coming in as well that have some experience. So when we put all that together, I think we'll have a very strong team. Right. Um, Coach, what, what, do you, what do you tell your, the fans? Because it seems like the men get most of the support, and I want to see the women get support, just as much support, if not more. Well, we've got to get out and get fans in the stands, and I, I think, you know, hopefully if we'll continue to win, we'll be able to get people interested in our game. But we're going to go out, and we're going to try to get fans to come to our game and have that experience of watching us. Um, come on. This, this could help. Come on out, CQ Arena. See the defending CAA champs. That's right. Come out and see the defending champs. You won't be disappointed. It's an exciting game. You heard her? You see her. That's head coach of Towson University, Diane Richardson. Thanks a lot, and hope to see you out there.